Evaluation question 7. Looking back at your preliminary exercise, what do you feel you have learnt in the progression from it to the full product? I believe that I have improved my understanding of generic media conventions from my preliminary exercise to the main task. For example, I have taken better photos for my main cover image so that the text looks better and fits with the colour scheme, which I have also improved as last time I had used a mixture of random colours on my main image, which made the preliminary exercise look unprofessional. However, this time I have taken it into more consideration and have made the colours not only suit the genre of music it is representing, but I have also made it look more professional. I have also learned that researching into different types of magazines can really help you not only to better understand the codes and conventions of magazines, but how to better represent the artist, band or subculture you are covering. This makes the magazine better suited to the audience and makes the audience want to read it. Moreover, planning your magazine can help a lot. For example, if I didn't plan when to do my photo shoot, I may not have even got any done or they may not have been to the quality that the rest of my magazine was. Furthermore, Having good organisation skills is incredibly important to create a good magazine as I have lots of photos and experience that I wouldn't be able to find if I didn't put them into certain folders with labels. Also, if I didn't use my planner, I wouldn't have known what I needed to focus on greatly improving my time management and allowing me to effectively get on with the work that I needed to do. Backing up work is also incredibly important to making the most of your time as I would have needed to do all my work all over again which were taking up a large amount of time and negatively affected my final product if I didn't back it up to on, onto a USB stick. I have also learnt that working with others is also very important to creating a successful piece of work as you can share ideas and help to show each other how to use Photoshop in a design. If I was to do this task again I would reconsider what clothing I use for the models as I could have definitely made them look more like a punk band. Moreover, I would have taken pictures in more locations and with different models so that I could use more photos for my contents page. 